For California Air National Guardsmen at the 129th Rescue Wing, War Skills is much more than a training sides, exercise. War Skills training is basically designed uh, to help uh, Air Force members prepare for contingencies or uh, deployments and things of that nature. So you're in charge and you want to be clear, concise, and quick. So two words is easy, preparatory command, prepare to move, move. As part of their training, airmen put on MOP gear, or mission-oriented protective posture that protects against chemical agents. Airmen quickly become accustomed to wearing mop gear for hours at a stretch while moving from station to station. In a training environment, that's the best time to learn. You, you're going to make some mistakes and things like that, and that's okay. We would much rather have you to make those mistakes in this training environment than a real world environment. Out in the field, Airmen may also have to secure areas for unexploded ordinances or treat injuries using self-aid buddy care. The most important thing that everyone can, should take from self-aid buddy care is your airway management tools, whether it's head tilt, chin lift, jaw thrust, or placement of a nasal pharyngeal airway. War skills trainers also said they want airmen to feel they're ready to face what can happen downrange and that safety is always paramount. Reporting from Moffett Federal Airfield in Mountain View, California, I'm Airman First Class Brian Jarvis.